I don't know how somebody should feel after having a stroke, but it just didn't seem real for me to have to have a stroke. That day, went to work just like normal. Uh, and it just happened to be that the uh, person that normally empties the trash in what's called the quad in UNCG, they weren't there. So my supervisor, Tony, called me over to help him like do the trash run. I asked him a question and when he responded, his speech was slurred. So a red flag went off in my head. I was like, James, are you okay? And he was like, yes. And at that moment, he dropped his keys. When I got out of the truck, I tripped. And he's like, well, no, he said, that's not right. And then I couldn't get up. So that's when he really, he, he said, I'm calling somebody for some help now. We were able to get a CT scan right away, get his laboratory studies right away. We were able to see where his blockage was. With James, we, we found was we had, once we had discovered the blockage, we had to undo the blockage. The thing that works in these situations better is to put a device through the groin, open this device through a little tube, a microcatheter, capture the clot, and then remove the clot. He showed my wife the x-ray and showed the, the, the clot that got there. And from what he explained, it probably came from my heart, went up and just got stuck. Then they have something that goes in all the way through your veins, all the way up, and snatches it out. That means going in within six to eight hours after the stroke and pulling the clot out from one of the major blood vessels in the brain improves functional outcome. That means patients improve to the point that they can go home. I came back the next Monday, so I was out just that week. And Dave showed up to work a week later, later, ready to go. That's quite remarkable for stroke, and particularly a stroke uh, the size that he was experiencing when he arrived. If the stroke center wasn't here, if we didn't have uh, a protocol in place to treat him as quickly as we did, um, there is likelihood that he would have wound up a lot more debilitated. Cone Health is the place to go because it was, I'm gonna say, exceptional that what they did for me.